Hey sisters! <laughs> Today is a vlog and I don't really post any vlogs on this channel but it is the Tana Mojo and Friends vlog. So I went to the Tana show this week and it was a lot of fun. So this is a vlog of that event. But yeah, I'm gonna do like a little like overview or like recap kind of thing throughout this vlog. So yeah. So first, I woke up and I went to work from 8 a.m. to 12 to noon and this is me when I woke up being excited as hell for the day. Guys, today is the day. What day is it, you may ask? Well, today is the day that... Duh, duh, duh. <laughs> I go to Tana Mojo show in Orlando. Yay! And it's exciting because I didn't get to go to the first... I didn't get to go to any of the times she's been in Orlando. She's been for like VidCon. And I didn't go to that. And then this time, I'm going. And I'm just really excited. And I'm going to tell you guys a quick story while my car like warms up and stuff. Okay, how I got these tickets. So, it was my friend's, my best friend's birthday. And her boyfriend texts me and he's like, Hey, um, whatever her name, wants to, really wants to go to the Tana show and I don't want to go with her because you know, I don't really care about that. If I buy the ticket for you or you go with her, I was like, of course, like I love Tana. So that's how I got the tickets. And I made, did my eyebrow, but like, look how ugly it looks. Like I do not know how to do makeup. Oh well. So it's gonna be a long day because I have work and then I have class and then I have to rush home, eat, put some cute clothes on because I'm not gonna go looking like shit and then head over there. And I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna vlog the whole experience, so. And then after work, I had lunch and I usually have lunch by the reflection pond on campus. So I walked my little ass to the reflection pond and I watched the fountain and ate my lunch. And then there's always this one guy by the reflection pond that hands out like little like business cards and he's always preaching about Jesus and every day he tries to preach to me about Jesus and it's so annoying. So after class I got home and I changed into this outfit which was beautiful. May I say? So it's the time to start heading towards the show. And this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this like sheer pink like sweater thing from Forever 21. This bathing suit top from Forever 21. The skirt and some shoes that are matching my top. And when my friend was coming to my room or to my apartment, she asked me, what? what's your apartment number? So I told her my apartment number and she walked into the wrong apartment. Think this, she opened the door, the door was unlocked first of all, walked inside, knocked on my door, tried to open the door to, well, the, the door to where my room would be because all the apartments look the same and I, no one opened the door because it was locked. So then she called me and she said, hey, are you in your room? And I said, yes. And she's like, oh shit. So she walked outside and then she's like, what's your apartment number again? And then she, I was like, wait, let me walk outside. So I walked outside, I saw her, and she came inside. So then we tried to break into someone's house. That's it, we tried to break in. Guys, so my friend, I'm not gonna show you her right now until later, but she walked into the wrong apartment when she came to my place. So we're gonna walk in again <laughs> and see if anything happens. Oh, it's locked. God damn it. Damn it. We were gonna walk in, and then if. If they were like, what are you doing here? We're gonna be like, oh wait, wrong apartment. <laughs> oh, damn it. <That's laughs> Guys, tell me how my best friend is just my twin. I look on the side door of her car, and look what I find. Baby powder. And I'm like, hey, do you use this as your setting spray? And she's like, oh no. No, not setting spray. Do you use this as your dry shampoo? She goes, no, I use it as setting, setting powder. And I was like, oh my god, I use it as setting powder too. And I just think it's really funny because we're literally twins. And I just think it's funny that in a week's span, first I got in the wrong person's car, and then she goes into a random person's apartment. We're literally twins. So we finally get to the event, and I'm so excited. I'm walking up to the event. I see Tana's tour bus. Yes, girl, yes. <laughs> and then I walk towards the entrance, and then this happens. Guys, so they didn't let me bring the camera inside. So now, 
I'm gonna go drop it off in the car. But it just sucks because I want to vlog it, so I guess I'm gonna have to do it with my phone. So next clips are gonna be very bad, but it's okay. So here's the, all the footage of the event of Tana. She looks even beautifuler in person than on camera. I guess I'll just call myself an Uber. <laughs> I really hate talking to Uber drivers. He's probably just gonna kidnap me anyways. <laughs>
fall down seven times, and you're gonna stand up eight. And you're gonna come up a stronger, smarter, wiser person, Orlando. Jesus! I love you guys so much, I would not be here if it was not for you. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Goodbye. The show's over. It was pretty, I mean, it went by quick, but it was like longer than I expected it to be. Definitely. Yeah, like my feet started hurting towards the end. Oh, look, this is her bus. We were waiting by the bus. Can you see it? We were waiting by the bus to see if we could like get in or like get her when she comes out, like have her talk to us or whatever. But there's 20 people there and like, I don't think she's gonna come out anytime soon because first of all, I probably have to like pack up all their shit like from the stage and then I don't know. And there's a lot of people there and the security like came and like closed out her door and stuff. But yeah, the show was pretty good. It was funny. Everybody was screaming so loud. Like my head is hurting so much. But, yeah, I liked it. I would I would do it again. I, next time, I feel like it kind of sucked that the tickets that we got were general admission and they were like more expensive because she lowered the price. So we could have basically met her for like ten dollars more than we paid, right? So that would have been cool to meet her. Yeah. Next time. Next time. This is my friend. She's so cute. Okay. Bye. Guys. We just got pulled over by the cops. So we're like driving and then I see the cop lights behind us and I was like, oh, he's probably just asking you to move out the way. And then he, she moves out the way and he like follows her and I'm like, shit, we're getting pulled over. Like, what did we do wrong? Like, she's not speeding. We're driving slow as fuck. We're just talking. He, he's he behind, the, behind us? No, he's not. And he, she rolls out her window and she's like, can I ask you what's wrong? Like, why did I get pulled over? And he's like, I ran your tags and it says that it's a silver car and you're obviously not in a silver car and we're just like, oh, her dad paints cars because he, when she bought the car, it was silver and he painted it black. Nobody likes a silver car. Yeah. Well, I don't know. I, like silver. I don't mind silver cars. But, yeah, and then he like, he's like, can I ask you to turn your car off? So he turns, she could turn her car off and he like goes and he checks and then he's like, he's in, he didn't give you a ticket though, which is good. It's nice of him. He but, said that would have been a 100. Yeah, he's dollars. like, if your dad paints car, like if she lied to him, he would know that you have to change your registration and whatever, it's 140, whatever ticket. But yeah. And that's to end our night. <laughs> On that note, bye. <laughs>